Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. We are heading over to the cloud world known as Sky Die Heights. Yeah, it sounded like a skydive pun here. Because we flew through the air all the way into the clouds, on top of the clouds to be more precise, in 6-1. Let's get it started. Uh, Mo? That minecar was rough. But now we got getting chucked up here. Enough already. Let's just try and find a way down from here. Heh. <laughs> kind of reminds you of home, doesn't it? Eh, what's wrong? What are you looking at? Starvey! Did you just see what I just saw? That fluffy Uno? It swallowed a door. What? How do you swallow a door? I mean, you well, you can swallow a door, but, you know, the doors are like transportations to other areas. That means if you swallow the door, it's like you swallow a whole other area because the door doesn't exist and then you can't go through the door to the next area. Ah, I probably shouldn't question the game logic. Anyway, that couldn't have tasted good. If you want out of here, we gotta get the door out of its, his belly. If he's that hungry, maybe we can feed him more so we'll just spit up the door. Fluffy Unu is love to eat clouds. Should we call on Starly to help us make a whale of a buffet? Wanna call her? No. No, no, no. Okay, it's your call. But if you get swallowed by him, I'm not going in after you. So, we got these clouds here. We can knock them around. You can also get sucked in by this thing. <laughs> it doesn't really do anything, but it just, just kind of messes with you a little bit. Oh, did, did you eat that? Yeah, anyway, this uh, Fluffy Unu here. It's completely impervious to normal attacks. You gotta knock stuff. Oh, pfft, Xbox D pad. And knock stuff into him. Like that. He eats it. And he gets bigger like that. Anyway. Music sounds a little slow. Maybe it's the emulator. Anyway. <laughs> Maybe it's just slower than I remember it? I don't know. Anyway, there we go. Once he eats three clouds, there's the door. It appears out of nowhere. And look at that. Stuff even goes behind the door as if the, there's nothing behind the door. And oh, forget it. I, I shouldn't question that any longer. What do you have to say about me getting the door back? Go work getting Fluffy Unu to cough up the door. Great idea of mine, eh? What? Did you change your mind about getting Starly? Want me to call on Starly? No. No? Okay. Have some fun on your own then. Go get him. I shall. Alright, so, going through the mysterious, unquestionable door here, <laughs> uh, you can't go up, the, oh wait, you can go up this sort of waterfall, I guess it's another kind of waterfall that I was thinking of, hold on, hello there, clam, that was a slam clam by the way, uh, if you jump above them, uh, that's what they do, <laughs> they're like a trap enemy where you, if you try to jump over them, they uh, attack you. Oh, this is the waterfall. You can't go up right now. Urgh. I should say the waterfall type. It, the waterfalls are sort of like currents in a way, in that you can only get up them when, once you have certain abilities and whatnot. Uh, anyway. Oh, uh, stop. Oh, go. Oh, re repetitive dialogue. Repetitive dialogue. I don't even know why I bother with you, Glowbirdo. I guess just in case that off chance you might have something new. Oh yeah, you can swim in rainbows! Woohoo! I've always wanted to swim in rainbows, except for the fact that rainbows are not very solid, and I probably shouldn't question that logic either. Uh, these little sharks are snarks, maybe a combination between snack or like snarky and shark, maybe, might be, could be. There's a lot of possibilities for that. Any, oh wait, was there anything more to the right? I don't think there was, because I think the screen ends there. Yeah, okay. We're just going by memory there, and I kind of went back by instinct. Anyway, oh, oh, yeah, Xbox D-pad made me slide, because <laughs> I swear, I swear I pressed the Y button. Starlet, Surfy, look at this! It's just like the stone we found back in Chili Dip Cove! Maybe you use it to transform into something new. Weird, there's a chicken on this one. Let's call this transformation power Roostar! Alright. Got anything else to say? I feel I want to remember something. It's always like this just on the tip of my brain. Brains have a tip? No, forget it. You found one of Bunsen's mysterious powers! Check it out on the ability screen, which they are going to automatically show you right off the bat. Wah! Unleash an ear splitting. To bombard enemies with a sonic shockwave! Yeah, you see that thing? Remember that thing in the other level? That's a lift wisp. 
yeah, lifts you up to things when you next to it. And uh, that spiky thing that uh, was stunned to be able to uh, stand on top of is a lurchin. So yeah, this uh, power is very, very, very useful. As you will see very shortly. <laughs> So let's move on. Wait, actually, one more thing. Got anything else to say? I feel... Nope, nope. Something, nothing new. Nothing new. All right, let's switch back to Mo, because he is the most important thing ever for collecting everything. Here we are, chicken! Woo! Yeah, you just attack with the Y button. You can attack things right off screen. Combo... Well, not right off screen, but I, what I mean is... Uh, um, even off the beaten path because it penetrates walls and everything. It's a pretty powerful little power as yeah, you probably got there. I have the power of Kukos on my side. Nothing will be able to stand in my way now. <laughs> By the way, this is a pretty nice place to get pearls, by the way. You just respawn those guys and then, yeah, combo attack, yeah. <clears throat> anyway, moving on. By the way, those eggs, not really useful, are they? <laughs> They're like y Yoshi's eggs, but you can't throw them at stuff. You just got the... They're just eggy details. <laughs> Uh, wait, I shouldn't go up here just yet. What's down over here? A wall! Well, it's not a wall, it's the edge of the world. So that was completely useless to do, and I just wasted all of our time. Isn't that nice? <laughs> anyway, come on, Lift Wisp. Go, 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 there we go. Uh, when you're in chicken form, you are kind of sluggish, so keep that in mind with stuff and stuff, yeah. But it's not, like, debilitatingly... Uh, sluggish because I mean you just look at this you've got the baga and you can attack pretty much everything on screen without any issues whatsoever <laughs> yeah you're as a chicken you're pretty overpowered oh no I can't I can't stay underwater on my own oh shoot and listen to that baga underwater <laughs> yeah it's a little bit different there um, these are snoins. They throw their coin-like snail house uh, off, and yeah, you see how they attack. <laughs> Love how the audio uh, for that gets distorted as you go, um, as you attack with that. By the way, in order to dive, you actually gotta um, press the jump button to go underwater. Anyway, I'm going over here because there's some. Oh, wait, uh, oh this isn't the thing. I think that's the way forward. I think there is more to be seen up this way. Uh, I know the other way is pearls, so I'm gonna... Oh, no, no, no! Dang it! <laughs> You're just gonna give me trouble, aren't you, Lift Wisp? Aren't you? Okay, I'm gonna do this ahead of time, just to get a platform going. There we go. That's using the old noodle, or in this case, a doodle. No, wait, a doodle, a chicken doodle isn't a brain, no frick. <laughs> oh, Pearl Heaven! Yes! Like Star Bits and Super Mario Galaxy. Alright, I'm, I'm, by the way, in case you don't realize, I'm saving up a lot of pearls for something. In fact, I'm trying to save up my pearls to get to, um... 9,999 to buy the most expensive thing in the shop just right off the bat uh, Yeah, so <laughs> It's what I like to do first just because it makes things a little bit easier in my opinion Anyway, get out of my way. I gotta get down here before you spike me again It's like everything is against poor Starfy and chicken and money and clam no one likes anyone around these parts, I guess. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> Alright, save. Oh, the reason why I haven't really been saving in the last couple of parts was because I haven't been backing up my save file. Yeah, I know that's, um, it's, it's bad to do that, but I, I was just kind of lazy at the time. I was just playing from one level to the other without, um, stopping. Anyway, if you transform into Roostar and let out our big you'll wake up.
pick up every creature for miles. It can really come in handy when you want to wipe out a bunch of enemies all at once. No kidding. <laughs> that other room sure showed that. When you change it to Roost Star, you can even lay some eggs. It's a little weird, I guess, but it's all a part of the fun. Uh, let's go down here. Ah, yeah, you can go back up, don't worry. I just want to see the lower paths first, because I think there is good stuff to be had down here. I think. That's a Cupid, like the letter Q and PID. Q-P-I-D. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you know what pun that name is off of. Let me up the waterfall. Yeah. Come on, Starfy. Believe you are a salmon and climb those waterfalls. Well, spit up the waterfalls. They sort of jump up the waterfalls, the salmon. Okay, I reached that end. Now I can start going back and taking the regular upper path. Okay, okay. Wait, 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 what's down this way? What's down this way, clams? I know they're there, but what else is down here? That is the question. A door? Was I, did I already go through this door? I don't know if I went... Th I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Okay, let's climb up the waterfall and... Hmm, hold on a sec. Is this the way forward? It feels like this is the way forward. I'm gonna do... Ow! I'm gonna go take the upper path. Let me... Oh, this isn't the way I get back up. <laughs> I need to go find the rainbow. Ah! Zip! <laughs> Didn't see you. There we go. Follow the rainbows. Follow your nose. Uh, okay, see, this arrow is pointing this way, and then... There's the other pathway there. See, like, I think... Oh, that is the end, okay. Can't do that! <laughs> we can't go to the end just yet, we still have more stuff to find. But okay, yeah, the upper path is the path forward, and the other one is the so and so kind of secret path, I guess you could say. It's not all that secret, though, because you just, yeah, you jump down here, and then, oh, there it is. <laughs> I, mean, I suppose it's sort of secret. Anyway, I'm gonna work my way up and then back down sorry for all the sidetracking here but there's a lot of non-linear paths are in these levels ah uh, no 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 by the way those cupids can shoot the little arrows at you by the way yeah mini g's challenge two behold it is i mini g the minigame magician. For all lovers of minigames and all soon to be lovers of minigames, now's your chance. I'll introduce you to my newest minigame. Come see me in Sky Die Heights when you can. Alright. That won't be later. Until later, I mean. <laughs> there we go. Alright. Alright. Moving on. Whee! Ah. Whoa. You move so swiftly in the water, and then you transition to land, and you gotta switch control schemes. It's kind of weird sometimes, especially when you have to do it really quickly. <laughs> oh, I couldn't get up there! <laughs> oh, I thought I could get up there with a double jump, but I guess not. It's rainbows all the way, I guess. Nope, nope. Ooh, I did this before, there we go. D-pad! Why do you hate me so? Microsoft, why do you hate gamers so? Always test your D-pads before you release them. <laughs> Alright, the level is 100% it. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.